Okay, let's just create a quick video of illustrating how to create the data dictionary. It's a simple process. Like if you have already, you already have a, a an existing data set on the SPSS, you create new data, and you get a blank window. From this blank window, you have to two views at the bottom. We have data view and variable view. The data view is where you fill in the, you manually fill in the data, like you type the data set that is given. But for the column names, that's the data dictionary. We create it in the variable view. So let's say for instance, with the first one, which is ID num, it's type numerical, width we let it mean uh, the default decimals because we need whole numbers we reduce to zero label we use the given label which is you just type it Values, we, they are custom values, there are no default values on categories, so we let it remain none, missing the same. The other thing that we need to set is measure to nominal, the role we let it remain at that. We do all that for all the non-categorical data, but for categorical data like sex, we create it. We reduce the decimal numbers. So, for label, we will also use the, the one given. But for values, we have values where zero represent female, add, and one represent male and okay then set the measure to nominal because it's also nominal and it's as simple as that to create a data dictionary you'll do that for all the others then when you come back to data view you see the ones that you've created they are the column names now now from here you can fill in your data for sex you have zeros or ones And you, you'll see that for the ones that, for the categorical data, using this bit button here, you can change from numbers to text. It's just a toggle button. When you click once, you get the other. And that's how easy it is to create a data dictionary.